Hey everyone and welcome back to Hayes Kitchen. Now today I'm going to show you to do a really easy, beautiful summer dish. We're going to do a whole roast chicken. We're going to do that with lemon, thyme, garlic, honey infused. We're going to serve that up with a really, really fresh strawberry and mango super salad. Now if you want to learn how to make the salad, click here and I'll show you how to do that. Then come back and we'll get on with the chicken dish as well. So ingredients wise we have, so we've got a whole organic chicken, we've got one lemon, We've got half a tangerine, half a whole clove of garlic, then we've got some sea salt, some new potatoes, we've got a little bit of honey, we've got some white wine, we've got a little bit of thyme, and we've got some fresh olive oil. First up, you'll need a pan. Now, the beauty of this dish is, because it's a whole chicken, you can share that with the whole family. Um, if you've got the kids want to get involved, they can have some of the salad. We're putting strawberries and mango in there, so they're going to love that anyway. But also, if you're a student and you want to cook on a budget, do a whole roast chicken and do that amongst your student friends, four or five people. You're going to save a lot more money than cooking it up for yourself. Um, so, we've got ourselves a little tin tray. We're just going to plonk the whole chicken straight into the tray. Wash your hands as soon as you touch chicken before you touch anything else in your kitchen. Once you've done that, we're gonna take the chicken, we're gonna take one of our lemons. This is such an easy summer fresh dish. So uh, in the winter, do this with loads of mixed vegetables instead. In the summer, do it with a salad. Um, take half a lemon, just literally just plop that in the tray. And the same with the half a bulb of garlic. Chuck that straight into the tray. Now those lemons and the honey and the white wine and the garlic, it's gonna caramelize. So when we put the new potatoes in, they're gonna roast off and get a lovely sticky sort of light outside to them. So the new potatoes can go in, chuck them in. Half an orange or a satsuma, whatever you have on hand, leave that hole again. Again, sugar's gonna come out and caramelize. The honey and the white wine, we don't put through until about an hour's time. So we're gonna roast the chicken for an hour. That's gonna baste off, cover it in tin foil, let it steam and take in all the juices. And then we're gonna put a little bit of honey on there, a little bit of white wine, that's gonna infuse it slightly, and then it's gonna caramelize over the top of the chicken. So a little bit of salt, just literally over the top of the pan. Your thyme, I'm gonna plonk straight on top of the breasts. Olive oil. Now I'm gonna put quite a good helping on in here. Amongst the new potatoes as well, over the orange, over the lemon, over the chicken. Now I want to seal that up. So rather than putting that straight in the oven and it just going crispy and going very, very dry, I want to seal that up with a little bit of tin foil so it starts to steam first of all. Tin foil over the top. Now, important with tin foil. Tin foil always says non-stick. Liars. Now leave a gap in between the chicken breast and the actual foil. Fold that all the way round. So into the oven, 250 Celsius. Cook that for one hour before we baste that with a little bit of honey and a little bit of white wine. Right, let's get out the oven. There we have it. Beautiful oven roast chicken with lemon thyme, honey, orange. Got all these beautiful flavors going through that chicken. I'm gonna serve this up with our salad. Now with the chicken, just literally take that straight out of the tray, plonk that onto your serving board. So there we go, you've got your beautiful summertime chicken dish with a little bit of lemon, thyme, garlic, and a little bit of honey going through there, and then your easy summertime salad as well. Hope you enjoyed that one, guys. And if you want to check out my blog, it's www.hastekitchen.com. Um, it's full of all live updates on book reviews, food reviews, um, some of the recipes are going on there as well. Um, give it some love, give it a follow, give it a subscription, and yeah, you get regular updates from me. Um, other than that, please go to Instagram if you recreate any of this foods and hashtag me at Haste Kitchen, and I shall see you all next week. Cheers then, bye bye. Thank you.